It's Spooky Science Series time, and today's story is absolutely nuts. So, this is a vulture's nest, and inside this nest was a shoe, and not just any shoe, a 650 year old shoe. Here's what happened. Scientists rappelled down these cliffs in the Pyrenees, searching for bearded vulture's nests to analyze what is in them. And they did not expect to find what they found. This shoe plus 200 other human artifacts. And listen to this. Some of these items date to the Middle Ages. I repeat, the Middle Ages. But we haven't even gotten to the real mind-blowing part yet. This particular shoe is 675 years old, to be precise, per carbon dating. It's a sandal woven from grass and twigs, likely worn by someone from southern Spain in the 1300s. A shoe like this should have decomposed centuries ago, but the cool, dry air of the cliff cave preserved it perfectly, to the point where you can still see the individual braids of the woven grass and the general craftsmanship of whoever made this shoe six centuries ago. And here's what's so wild about all of this. This shoe and other artifacts stayed in this vulture's nest for six centuries, with generations of vultures carefully maintaining this nesting site from the Middle Ages all the way to today. Today, I think we all learned that vulture nests are real life time capsules, and they might be one of the coolest new ways to learn about human history. And what's even more fascinating is that this whole reusing of nests over centuries is not unique to just vultures. There's a golden eagle nest in North America with so many layers of material added to it over the generations that it's now 20 feet deep. And in Greenland, there's a gerfalca nest that is, wait for it, more than 2,000 years old. This nest was being used when the Roman Empire still existed. Here's what else scientists found in these vulture nests. A slingshot woven from grass, a crossbow bolt, and a scrap of sheep leather painted with red ochre from six centuries ago. These objects tell us what people were carrying, what they were wearing, what they were using to hunt, all preserved by accident in a vulture's nest on a cliff, and there's still tons more waiting to be analyzed. For centuries, archeologists have been digging down into the earth to uncover human history. Meanwhile, vultures have been collecting it for us, piece by piece, generation by generation, stashing it away in their nests like accidental museums. Vultures are apparently nature's archivists. Now that is some spooky science. If you want another spooky science story about vultures, let me know below, cause I've got a good one. Follow for more spooky science series all October long, and make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because we are dropping a Halloween episode at the end of this month.